Three, two, one, go, go. That was good. That was that even was worse. I, yeah, think, was, I think that, that was, was it. That was it? Yeah, I think we, that was it. We you think got that was it? it? Me and We're so Derek, good. I think. Work with it. <laughs> We're so good, Derek. I will kill you. <laughs> I mean, this is me. It's like me and Trin got it like on a go on like on point. I was a little behind, yeah. so just pull me a little back in. Yeah, we're, right. we're we're on it. Don't worry. Yeah. All right. We're well, on it. welcome everybody to episode two of Gorilla Gossip. I'm one of your hosts, Shoji. We're here with a I'm guest. Another host, Widow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was Hello. Introduce you two. We have. But that's fine. Hello. <laughs> Interrupt. This is why we gotta coordinate these things. We gotta That's coordinate. Very true. That's very true. We don't coordinate shit because we do shit last minute. Coordinating is for nerds. True. Any- so, in build up to Capcom, after Capcom Cup ended and all the Street Fighter news, you know, it only felt right to put Street Fighter on the podcast. Whoa, I'm Street. They also played Two B or something. No, not Two B. Grand Blue. Something. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, welcome, Trinity. I am Street Fighter. Hello. Introduce yourself. Talk. Say <laughs> words. Hello. Hello. I'm Trinity. I am a professional Zangief player for Newhead. Yada yada. I grab people. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty, pretty swag. Yeah. Hell yeah. So, <laughs> I guess we'll just get right into. We'll go in. I guess order of what things happened, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, um, well, unless we wanted to open up with that other thing. I, right? I think we could open. I think let's open up with the other thing because this is going. This is definitely going to go live past March 1st. Yeah. Um, yes. And with that being said, our very sponsor, you know, right next to me, which is why I kind of have this background up, kind of announced something pretty cool. Um, I don't actually know. Is it? I think it's just for their Fausts, right? Fausts. Yeah, I believe it's just Fausts, right? Yep. But they now have art, and they have provided most members of an of an H with a art and Faust. Like a Faust a customized Faust. Hit box. Um, yeah. So, so we are being sent everyone in this podcast and a like large number of the team is being sent custom Faust hit boxes from SGF. Right. We all got to design ours ourselves. Um, I don't know if by the time this is going up you'll have seen them yet. Uh, but I mean, most of us probably put them on our Twitter already. So if you want to see them, go <laughs> we'll there, put go we find can put them. our most threes definitely. up. We can send like I know we can put our threes. Yeah, we up. can get them all put up on screen. Um, I forgot to turn oh, yeah. the timestamps on. Oh, yeah, we can do that. My- <laughs> He'll live. He watches this whole thing anyway. Right. Um, <laughs> mine is completely done. I just paid yeah. for, like part of it or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, uh, that's pretty. It's pretty awesome. You know. Oh um, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think they've printed mine yet. Um, I don't no, think they no, printed they, mine either. I'm not sure. Yours may be Trinity, but Widow, I don't. They just oh, got yeah. your PSD. I yeah. can actually yeah. look. Um, it doesn't matter. They're, it'll get done when it's done. You're right. It'll they're be done when it's done. Amazing, yeah. They're doing amazing stuff. I'm not. I'm not. No, SGF is phenomenal, dude. Yes. Yeah, no, they make incredible they, stuff. They did. Um, they did mine and Meeks today. So. If you guys want a good laugh, you know I'll be streaming the day I get mine. I will also be streaming. I've never played on a lever list before, so it's going to go really bad. <laughs> Solemn cooked on your design um, video. I fucking love it. He did. It he did. So much. Oh, you know, I Solemn did like sent, crazy. I sent him a shitty, like, I put a white background, I put a web in the corner, and the logo in the corner, and I'm like, there you go. And he's yeah. like, bet. I'll work with it, and now it's it's amazing. It's, it, it's my favorite, but I'm totally biased. I mean, uh-huh. you've seen my uh, Willow, right? <laughs> yeah, I like I like yours. Yeah, yeah yours is pretty sick. Yeah. I, you know, mine is the best, but, um, you know... <laughs> you know, mine is, you know my, mine is actually the best. <laughs> you know who's I think yeah. is the best? Widows. Actually, who's? Actually, you think Rats is on your own I think Widows or Popcats is the best. I love Popcats, too. Um, I, say, I think Popcats is OD. I, I also really like uh, Kilovens, like the one I did for Kermit as well. Yeah, Kilovens is good. Yeah. yeah. And Kermit's is good. I, I, don't th- I think a lot of them are... I think everyone cooked on their designs. I think yeah, everyone... No, every, really everyone looked crazy. I don't know, the designs are all really good. Have you seen uh, Kermit's tr- trend? I have not, no. Okay, I, I'll, I'll send it to you so you can like, have a visual. Okay, dope. Yeah. I want to see it. Yeah, yeah. Um, so... <laughs> yeah, you take a peek at that, and then I guess we'll start talking about uh, Capcom Cup, and we can start talking about like the LCQ... Kind of how that went and how that shaped up. Because I think it... Oh, wait, that goes so hard. I think <laughs> no one, yeah. no one was ready for how that was all going to go. Yeah, literally no one was ready for that. Topic. No one could have predicted all that. I mean, so I didn't watch the LCQ. I only watched Top 16. 
LCQ kicked off with what we mostly expected until top eight. Yeah. And then top eight was insane. Problem X takes it at the end of the day. Incredible. Like, we're lucky that Bison isn't in this game. Yeah, yeah. He absolutely. He <sighs> he lost a Punk in winners earlier. He got annihilated. Came back and fought Punk through through Grands after getting destroyed, and he made Punk look kind of stupid. <laughs> yeah. Like Punk is is one of the best to ever do it, but man, got looked foolish. Yeah. Dude, the problem X figured him out really good, and he just couldn't adapt. It happens to the best of us. It was a long day. You burn out. You ran out of fuel. Yeah. And then we got to see the epic power that was... Uma. Why the fuck oh. did you not seed the pools, Capcom? Oh, yeah, no. That shit was ass. <laughs> we got to witness the worst... The worst seating. ran event ever. The, <laughs> the seeding? Seating so they had... Eight groups. They had eight groups. There was no of, seating. What was, was it? No five? Seating. And there was no seating in these groups. The there was no seating. Was there was a new format, which I liked the format on paper. We get we got to see more matches and more people got more chances to show their stuff. I think it was a good idea. They didn't yes. seed it. So they pulled by regions. They had this big like machine that looked like an upside down bong. Yeah. <laughs> that blew wind in from below, like air. Yeah. To push these little balls out, people's names on them. And they sorted them by region. And the whole point of this was so that people wouldn't play each other if they're, like, in the same region. But it First failed. off, this didn't work. No, it, it didn't. didn't work. People the were playing each other in their region. People that were in the same region were playing each other. So first off, it didn't work. I mean, work. Mena and Second off, got in the same. Yeah. Yeah. Also the, two, also, the two African representatives were in the same pool. Yeah. yeah. So that happened. And then the big problem as well was they didn't seed any of this. So instead of by seeding, as they should have been, they did by region. So the region failed, clearly. The seeding didn't exist. So you have the Snake Eyes pool of <laughs> Three one DJs. Zangief, one Luke, and four DJs. Yeah. <laughs> and you have the Group F, which was all the top seeds for the whole tournament. Both the birds, Big Bird and Angry Bird, two of the best players in the world, both of them didn't make it out of pools because yeah, of this. Yeah, they didn't make it. Yeah. Although Meta LaShar fell group right away. LaShar, like, was in Group F came out of nowhere and annihilated everyone. He got like, what was it, fourth at the actual Yeah, it was like fourth or third. It was something like that. He did amazing. Well, third was Gachi Kun. Yeah. Oh yeah, third was Gachi We can talk about Gachi Kun's run later because that yeah. was inspiring. It was so sick. Um, so the seeding thing failed entirely because they didn't seed it. They did, I don't think they even seeded the actual tournament itself because I think if you were on Start GG and clicked so projected, I think Nephew was number one seed. Like, yeah, oh, oh yeah, what? Nephew was number one seed, wasn't he? Like, no one, it was not seeded at all. I, I do love, though, that they did end the show by being like, by the way, next year, we don't have the money to do it again. So yeah. we're doing it again! So <laughs> they're doing, they're doing again. the million the million thing again. They're doing million dollars Wait, first I place thought, again. I thought it was a million dollar prize pool, not a million dollar for first place. No. No, no, no it was a two million, million dollar prize pool, and a first place got a million. Yes. Yeah, so this, and they're doing it again next, for the second one. Next year, it's just a they're million. They're doing the same thing. No, they're not. No, no, a million gets, first place gets a million again, is what they said. Yeah. I don't know if everyone, if the, 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 I hope that they divvy the money a little better, oh. though, because getting fifth place at Capcom Cup X was probably, was it fifth or was it, I think it was fourth. Mm -hmm. You know what's crazy, though? It was like, the jump was 10,000 to 100,000. Yeah. It was yeah. like depression. You know what's crazy? The person who what? got 16th place still got more money than anybody who ever won an MK event. Damn! Yeah. That's crazy! <laughs> you right. You're like, right. Yeah. In, in, in that's, actually, that's another thing we can talk about later, I guess. We can talk about Peacemaker later. Uh, yeah, um, if I... yeah, we can briefly go over that. So, yeah. this whole event happens, and Gachi Kun runs through all of Rashid's worst matchups to get to third, only losing to Rashid's worst matchup, Luke, at the end, after beating like four other ones. Gachi Kun showed something that I think a lot of people in the FGC need to hear, and I'll say it here too. Your character strength does not mean shit. Yeah. Okay? I get it. There's some bullshit characters out there. I mean, look at what JP used to be before he got gutted, which we'll talk about in a bit. <laughs> I'm All right? happy. Look at what Potemkin players have been dealing with for, like, 20 years. All right? <laughs> you don't hear them complaining much anymore. You know why? Because they're just like, we'll learn, and we'll figure it out. We'll overcome yeah. the problems together. I, mean, I promise you, your character is not that bad. Uh, one of the best pot players has dropped pot. Dropping yeah, pot. I mean, yeah, after like three years of playing Potemkin in Strive, wait, wait, it gets a little, I, 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 I like, thought, sad. Wait, I, I, thought, I thought it was just a Gold Lewis second day. A boy is going to Gold Lewis, yeah. Yeah, I, I, thought it was yeah. Just a second, yeah, I thought it was just a second day, yeah. Yeah, no, 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 like, I'm pretty... It's, still, it's to... still in the early stages. We'll yeah. see what he does. Yeah, no, yeah, he was probably just transitioning over right yeah, now. He, yeah, no, he is. He's just, he's, he's fully Obviously, I mean, after... 
After playing a, a low tier for like three years, I get it, right? Yeah. Like Pot, Strive Pot's been drowning for about three years. And I mean, he's definitely not that bad in this version, but you can still feel it when you go up against the top tiers. You can still feel it for sure. Yeah. And when it comes to Street Fighter VI, that's where the matchup like aspect of a tier list is where, that's where like the tier list for Street Fighter comes together, right? Strive and Guilty Gear's tier list are built around how bullshit are you. Street Fighters are built around how good is your matchup chart is like a lot of it. And the reason Rashid is like, not a top tier despite having like ridiculous safe jumps great desert storm uh incredibly strong oki it's because he does not do well in any of the good of the good characters yeah. mm -hmm. he does terribly into all of them but ken from what i remember hearing because uh, he, he goes even them. with ken. Not good in ken yeah he goes even into ken from what i heard yeah. I, I heard big bird say that i think it was yeah like yeah like uh, and that, that, that's got to mean it's got some truth to it <laughs> Um, yeah, Big Bear is probably one of the best Rashids in the world. <laughs> yeah, so Gachi Kun goes through, gets third, and then Uma wins the entire tournament solo jury, which is incredible. But there is one thing about this event, besides obviously, oh, the Crouchy Medium Cup, you know, Luke and, and all this Lovely. stuff. They made the decision after the tournament was over to interview Chris Wong, who got second. And that might have been the most insensitive thing I've ever seen in the FGC. Oh, it was so tragic, ever. dude. Poor guy. He clearly wanted to cry. Yeah, like... Like, the, it was so, fella, so rude and not... It wasn't fair to him, and it no. just... It was such a bad look, and I hope that Capcom and the, and the people who are running the show did privately apologize to him. Yeah. Because he did not deserve that. That was just completely uncalled for, and I have no respect yeah, for that. Honestly, that it, was, it was rude. A I, I see where you're coming from, but it didn't seem like it seemed like he was upset. Yeah, but it also seemed like he was more. I thought he was more happy because he was like, "Uma's my training partner. Like I'm happy," type of thing. Yeah, for sure. But he but still, that so even distraught. regardless, that shouldn't have happened. Even yeah. regardless, that should never have happened. Especially seeing as what if he was even more distraught about it? Right. Because people are good at hiding stuff, right? I mean. I think it was you kind of uncalled I mean, for. How no, they I, I take that back because you gotta be distraught over a million dollars. Oh, you yeah, lo yeah, you yeah, lost yeah. seven hundred thousand dollars to yeah, a checkmate. Yeah, you, just, you just lost seven hundred thousand dollars, brother. Like, I that's... mean, to a checkmate. To be that's fair, not a like Uma kind of cook. Oh, Uma played. Uma played out well. of their mind. Uh, that was. But it like, doesn't change. It doesn't change the fact that like, no matter how good my opponent played, if I just lost seven hundred thousand dollars, do not talk to me. Do not put a mic up to my face and a camera and go. So how did that feel? Yeah. I will kill you if you do that to me. Like, yeah. no, I don't want any part of that. Yeah, no, that that was it was not very hype. Yeah, no, it was it was terrible, and, I, and it was not called the for. The chat on Twitch was so cringe. I believe it was like that show Akuma. Like Ed wasn't even out yet. Like, yeah, like brother. I mean, they did kind of say like, oh, we got one more thing. It's like, oh, are they gonna tease Akuma at us? And it's like, no, they're giving us the prize pool for the next Capcom <laughs> no. Cup, which I mean yeah, makes no. more sense than Akuma. I'm gonna. I'm going to call um, it right now. They're going to tease Akuma to Red Bull Kumite. That would not surprise me at all. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah no. teasing, teasing Akuma uh, uh, on finals day for Red Bull Kumite would not shock me because he is scheduled for spring. Mm -hmm. And they did take a big break for Ed, partially because they had to redesign his whole kit, but also because they they were on winter break. And mm -hmm. I'm assuming that after the massive blowout success that was Street Fighter VI, they were given a very healthy Christmas bonus and were told yeah. to enjoy their time off. Because they have been doing a great job. Mm -hmm. And after that balance patch came up, it's clear they've been paying attention. Um, so after we them. spent the after we spent the Capcom Cup uh, actual like real cup day, not the LCQ day, people got to play Ed there, and we got to see the return, the legendary return of the balance patch via shaky hand cam footage. Yeah, we got it. It was OD. <laughs> but unlike the Guilty Gear players, people were right this time about almost yeah, everything laughed. they mentioned. People were actually right. The Street Fighter scene actually was paying attention to things, and they were right about nearly everything. I have the patch pulled up right here. Yeah. Uh, and we'll just go over the like the big stuff, and then we'll talk about a little bit about Ed, and we the can JP get into the 2B gutting. and whatnot. Yeah. The crouchy medium punch on Luke got like giga hit. I don't. Not it's still it. ridiculous. It's just more of a punishable. Well, they, it's with punishable, and they made the the lower hurt box longer, so it's it. Yeah, I, it's I see like, that as a pretty big nerf. It's still a good button, but. It's still a god normal. It's not even just a good yeah. one. It's a like god normal still. But... They nerfed a super one. They nerfed aerial flash knuckle. They did a lot, right? You know, they 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 hit Ken's throw good. looping. They didn't they hit Kikoken on Chun Li? Um, I don't know. I, I'm reading it right now. That one I don't. Okay, remember. they made they made her stand light punch easier to whiff punish, yeah. and uh, they made aerial uh, tenjo kicks 
have 20% scaling. Wow, oh, that's a nerve. Yeah, that's that's, that's pretty big. That's... Yeah, like, wow, yeah, that, that's big. I mean, she did need something, but that no, might have been a lot. That, that was a lot. Buff. Yeah, that, that, that's a very No, she didn't need buffs. Chun Li is a top tier in that game. Nah, she's very good. I oh, you know she's extremely she's just fun. She's just super fundamentally sound, right? Buff Chun, those bars, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, every step she's... beneath of the ground must keep. <laughs> in my opinion, I think she's probably still definitely like at least up there with top five. I don't think JP's top five anymore. You know what's I crazy? Don't I don't play yeah. Super and I'm just saying random shit just to see if I can get something out of you two. <laughs> no, I, I think Zang is the best this character game. in the game. Like, y'all, y'all play this game more than I do, especially. <laughs> I barely like, I just... play this game. I played it today to play Ed, and that, that's the first time I played it, it in a month. Today, in like since before Aki came out. Like, I deleted it yeah, probably, it. like, a little bit after, maybe a month or two yeah. or three, even, after Rashid came out. Like, and then I was going to yeah, I mean, after all, the Aki, after all the Aki buffs, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I was going to read out for Aki. Oh, yeah, the Aki buffs. Player. Anyway, Aki's my yeah. main now. Fuck Rashid. Nice. She's a good character now. She's actually really good. Yeah, she's really good. good. She's really good. I, they fixed her a lot. They fixed some of her defense. And, right I, yeah, Jamie. Let's talk about Jamie, huh? Yeah, let's talk let's about talk that about character's Jamie. glow up. Because I'm scrolling down the list of the patch here. I gotta and say, Jamie... I, the one thing I did see about yeah. Jamie is that getting a drink after throw is kind of fucked. Like, a freak. Get, getting a drink after it, forward throw is... It doesn't sound I on paper like that it, good, no, but he gets... Very good. <laughs> stand medium kick drive rush after, guaranteed. That was one of his... That was one it's, of his, like, his, insane. Like, most, like, I, I remember, like, when the game first came out, because he was originally one of the main people I wanted to play. But, like, he was just struggle bus, struggle bus. Like... He would, yeah, yeah. He you're playing a level character like, that loses. E you're playing a level character that loses everything when they try to level. Right, because like, yeah. it's like you just get told to go fuck yourself. Like you have to go out of your way so much to level. But the fact that they and you have to give up so much Oki in so many scenarios that it yeah. was never worth it after the second one. Right. So the, this this <laughs> this buffs him to where he's actually in the game. We gave him his kneecaps back. Uh, side games take well, they, notes for more Percival. Too. Um, yeah. You know, give me my Percy back. We need some mercy for Percy. <laughs> no. Yes. No. Yes. yes. Like, give him like, his kneecaps back. I'm sorry for like <laughs> going away from. No, he first. needs. He needs his kneecaps. He needs. His kneecaps. No, he doesn't. He 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 can walk. He just needs fine. his kneecaps. He can walk just fine. He doesn't need them. No, he can't walk. He's bottom three. He has no kneecaps. <laughs> He's bottom three. He's bottom he can't three. Walk. He can barely crawl. He can barely <laughs> fucking crawl. Oh. <laughs> Anyway, that's uh, OD, bro. Street Fighter. I mean, army crawling around and shit. For real. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Jamie's level one got buffed. It does more damage. It does less pushbacks. It gets more Oki. Yeah, he gets better. And it's got five. One. You you takes five frames longer to recover, too, after, like, you get hit by this. So, his Oki went up tenfold. Yeah, his Oki. Level two no longer level. fucks you if you don't use it right away in Dude, the, level in the match. level two was such a useless super, but now it's actually. Level really two good. is now insanely good. Really? Yeah, now it's actually absurd. Yeah, level two no longer. So okay, before the way it yeah. worked is if you were drink, if you let's say you had two drinks, and then you did level two, which installed you to get to drink level four by default. When drink love, when the drink, the super art wore off, you were reset to zero drinks. Oh yeah. No longer does that happen. No. You are now put back where you were before. I, so the super no longer punishes you for using it at the wrong they spot. Buff him like does he keep his drink level after each round? No, oh. he didn't no. need that. He did not. People were saying he, that that would needed. I'm like, if he got that. He's top three. It's he's like, good. yeah, great. So Jamie spends the first round camping and giving up all uh, damage for Oki to sweep you the next two rounds because Jamie with max drinks is really strong. Jamie with max it drinks is been... arguably a top five character. It's not a top three. Character. Yeah. yeah, he's super. It's good insane. With max yeah. I mean, so Jamie, Jamie got everything he needed right now. We'll see how the meta shakes up with him in the next couple months and see yeah. if he's going to need a little bit more of a push. I don't think so. Leave I him for it. now anyway. Maybe give him a little bit of something to some of his random normals. Maybe make the dive kick a little better next patch. But besides that, leave it's him like alone. Know, it's atomic like it's, Red it's fine is enough. like, he is just giggling with joy. I know that for sure. <laughs> yeah, everyone is. He yeah, no, every, every Jamie player is just, is just in jubilation right now. Shout out to you. Same with Ryu yeah. players, dude. Yeah, same, same with the perfect segue. Thank you, the perfect setup. Yeah. <laughs> Ryu? I know, Ryu's good. patch notes. Ryu's notes are so long. Damn. You have to scroll numerous times to get yeah, through all they, of them. They, they gave Ryu some help. They really helped that character. Was he really Ryu that bad? Ryu EXTP's was better. Good. He, he wasn't, wasn't even, even that he bad. Even, no, he wasn't Ryu that wasn't bad. that bad. The problem is, is what needed to be done to him was a lot of minor, minor things. Yeah. So it adds up to a long list. Mm. Like, sorry. They they made solar plexus more consistent. Um, like so now people can't backwalk it while trying to block, and then yeah. you die. 
Light Hasho is now a true block. Like, going into Light Hasho is now OD. It's safe. It's safe. Right? O OD, OD, uh, Light it's Hasho like is RPS, safe. So it's not like in yeah. favor, but it's, it's better than being, than being like what minus it was. four and getting punished. Yeah. Ryu's uh, Light Hasho minus three is a big deal. He has an infinite block string now. He has all the shit he was missing on offense. He has real block pressure. He has uh, he is scary. Ho Hasho in general is now scary to block. Yeah. Which is what the move needed. And they also they also made Hadoken like the arms are not part of the hurt box anymore. Yeah, so it's way harder to punish. Which is for doing fire way fire. better. And they did that for his level one too. So Ryu, like the changes don't sound like a lot of, because the only reason there's so many changes is because they listed every Hasho, right? Like light, yeah. medium, heavy. Also heavy drive. Hasho leaves you in third range while being plus. So like, that's yeah. really good. Heavy good. Hasho is very scary plus to block you. now. But to be fair, you can DI it. You can DI it, yep. So, so you, got, you, you can it, look for it because you can see it. There's a lot of startup. Yeah. You can see it. I, so that's good, clear counterplay. That's I good. have no idea what uh, Mr. Hasho, whatever the fuck you all just said is. <laughs> <laughs> um, but you know, sweet, awesome. Yeah, the fake so fireball. So like Hasho fake is like the you know the fireball where he puts it directly in front of him and just like a little burst from his hands and it goes away. No. <laughs> you do not. You have never seen Ryu in your life. Hasho. Okay, he takes his hands and goes. Uh, and then like a little, of, uh, a little bit of a little bit of blue I, shit goes on his hands and that's it. I can't yeah, see like your face. Think of the fireball throw. Think about the fireball throw, yeah, except right. no fireball comes out. Oh, yeah. fireball throw okay. It's, it's like just a little kicks. thing on it. It's just a little pulse on his hands that the does some damage, yeah, right? It's like a little, it's a little That's bit what of it is. Okay. It's literally what it is. It's just piss. Yeah. Did you say it's just And piss? then in the end of the patch, because the rest of the notes are kind of like minor stuff. I think the only like thing worth mentioning is the, the, the sway is huge. Sway nerf is big. So the sway nerf was gigantic. Sway pulls in now instead of pushing away, which means it can be punished by SPD. Every not punished, time. not punished, but you're playing RPS. Well, yeah, but you're, you're playing RPS every time, which is way better than it used to be. You can't just sway anymore, thank God. Yeah. Like, DJ is no longer entirely brain dead. They have to do all his damage down still, probably, but this yeah. is a really good start. It's a really good band-aid to the problem at the moment while they wait to get the real the real fix. Yeah. Geef can... It's so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you can EX Lariat... Huh? You can... And on the first hit... You can combo into level three. Because the first hit crumbles it. for some reason. He needed it. He did. He needed it. But it just, it. it just sounds stupid. He Although it sounds stupid, but it was nowhere near the solution that every Geef yeah. player went this needed. It was nowhere yeah, no. near what people were going, hey, we need something to help. Oh, we got it, guys. EX Lariat into level three, but yeah, only on grounded hit combo. and only the first hit. Just, hey, we saved you guys. Level three. Yippee. Hey. He did but need there it. was one change that actually okay. was very, very good, and that is it the was level at the one level change. one. Yeah, the level one change was very good. They made the hitbox on it like like go lower, so it's more so it's more consistent of an anti air. So I was scrolling on Twitter and things. saw Geef level one Condor Spire and actually have my jaw hit the floor. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. Lily Lily Condor Spire does technically leave her airborne. So the super combo one. have the updated. Let me check if super combo has the updated hitbox yet. I have no idea. Probably. I'm gonna check because that shit is probably hilarious to look at. But like the buff is huge. It makes his side switch combos way more consistent. It makes it makes comboing level one in general just way more consistent. Do they it's way more Lily? way better, more reliable. They have not updated the hitbox yet. Lily, that's I don't true. think Lily got anything. I think she's actually unadjusted. Really? Yeah, she didn't get Lily touched. Really? Yeah, Lily. No, she didn't get. Shocked. I think it's because I think it's I think it's because the solution to Lily is a lot harder to find. I think, yeah, it's I mean, take honestly, a bit. it's just get make her good. You know. That's it. Yeah, so true. Make her good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, just no. make her good. Make her good. Yeah. She needs. She needs normals. She needs normals. She needs yeah. fast buttons. Is what she needs. She's slow no. She as just needs. Fuck. She, she has two normals. Period. She has two. Sand medium punch and crouching fierce. That's I know. It. Crowd, what is fierce again? I, I'm not a street fighter player. Um, heavy, uh, heavy, 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 heavy. Heavy. Okay. Uh, you know, if that's the one where she like hits you twice with her little fucking weapon thingies, right? Yes, that's like that's like her only good normal. I mean, that's a that's a good poke, yeah. But like, I remember because I played it a it's, lot. It's her normal. Um, I mean, I, if they just sped up or change uh, even some of her the hit boxes of like her standing buttons, I feel like she'd be a lot better. Like she can't really uh, catch drive um, drive rush. Whatever the fucking drive rush. Yeah, she she's not very good at checking. Yeah, she can't check it. She can't. She doesn't really get a lot it. of she doesn't get a lot of reward from her checks. Like like the best check you'll get is by like a sand medium punch, right. which is like back. Right, which is why I was kind of saying like like her hitbox is like or her hurt box, whatever the fuck to call it. I don't fucking whatever. Yeah, I draw pictures. Okay, <laughs> professional fighting game player. No, I draw pictures. I draw pictures. Here, look at my MS Paint. <laughs> that thing. I made my background. Anyway. Um, <laughs> 
<laughs> I need to look smart for one second. Look at this background. Look at, I mean. look at this. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I respect it. No. Um, uh, yeah, you know, I just I feel like she, if they change that, make it to where she can get actually have some sort of reward, she she'd be good. Yeah. Without yeah. you're on the right track. We just need to know the how. Right. The how do you get yeah, without there? The wind without bus. making her like, like degenerate and stupid. I'll say, but at the same time, don't give her normals and keep fire the way it is. Yeah. Yeah. So. Good. My character got a little bit of buffs. By a little bit, I mean about one one drop. Her back. You know, back one kick. drop. Mano, yeah, but it's a very big Mano, drop. It's like a back, very okay. big. Back kick is Mano, huge, back kick, back MK. That's huge. Uh, she can now drive rush and slide further with that, which means that she can force her RPS a little more consistently. Yes. Unfortunately, she has the worst drive rush in the game. But it's still something. Uh, and then they yeah. made the level two consistent, which is how it should have always worked, but I'll take it. Y'all want to witness... The stoning of JP. Oh yeah, oh yeah, true. Yeah, let's, let's talk about. They let's talk about stoned JP. this guy in the streets. Okay, I, heard you I got love the it. It's my, it's my best. Stand heavy punch. Now has is no box. longer a literal six P. It He's was a genuine box. six P before. Crouch, like, like so, stand heavy punch and crouch heavy punch, both have hurt boxes on them now. Yeah, crouch heavy punch is no longer air and vulnerable. So, so it was. So they made these moves fair. Because like JP old crotch heavy punch was a borderline DP. It was like it, it the pretty best much was a DP. <laughs> like it was insane, especially because you look at other similar attires in the game, like Luke's crotch heavy punch, reuse, hell even Mano's, which has different properties, and none of them had this thing where they were just like completely invulnerable. Yeah, no. Like I get it, zoners are supposed to have good anti-air tools to some extent. Like they're supposed to be good at keeping you out, but literally being impossible to contest, I think, is a different story. Yeah. Um, also, at special cancelable, so you had to play parry RPS after you got ANCA, yeah. which was very cringe. And that was every time, but now you can yeah. trade with him and not have to ever worry about that. Yeah. He has to be early to get to play that RPS, which I think is I think is fair or balanced, because it means he has yep. to be right about what you're doing. Yeah, no, he's, he's, got, he's got to actually... Oh, you know, yeah. Amnesia got hit really hard. Amnesia scaling um, now scales to dick and balls. Yeah, there's like no the reason to really to use the do the full combo anymore. If you're gonna do amnesia, like OD amnesia combos now, you are trying to get Oki, not a million damage, yeah, which is how just... it should have worked in the first place. You're you're trying to get screen positioning over Oki, really. You just want to get screen positioning, keep them full screen, zone them out. Yeah, I remember when the game first came like out, people were like, making. JP plays Mortal Kombat. Now he plays Street he Fighter. Does. Yeah, now he's finally got to play Street Fighter. Yeah, yeah he's got to play a little they... bit of Street Fighter. He's... Pierce is still a thing, so he's not playing full Street Fighter, but he's, he's playing a little bit yeah. of Street Fighter. He's and they, they put scaling on uh, Departure, the little portal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get Departure, awesome. the teleport, and the spike yeah. that comes out of like the little portal. That got hella hit. So it now and then I, I think definitely the unsung hero of the patch is, is Aki. Definitely. The stand medium punch, three to five frames active, is awesome. It means she can play proper, like, she can be meaty after throw more consistently without having to do like some like manual timing. It's just automatic yeah. now. And crouching light punch has a bigger hitbox. Like so they they dragged her out a little bit. Moves. Yeah, these these little things they did, as much as they aren't a lot, is enough for now. Yeah. It, let's see how it shakes up. Right. Overall, the, for a first patch, awesome. And then obviously, the thing we haven't talked about in almost thirty minutes. Who? Ed. Oh. Ed. Yeah. This character is so After, fucking sick. <laughs> he's super cool. He's super hard. We'll obviously swap into other games in a little bit and talk about what else has been going on, but I'll let the person who actually knows what they're talking about talk about Ed. Yeah, so okay. me. All right, so Ed I was playing him. Is, yeah, show uh, <laughs> Yeah, Ed is so cool. Yeah, you know, well, he does, like, punches and, like, purple yeah, true. He does. You know... He yeah. got that too. Yeah, yeah, he's got purple shit. Yep. <laughs> uh, his jacket's blue. His jacket's blue. His jacket's yep. blue. Oh, and then he's emo. Like, his theme song is, Tonight will mm -hmm. be yeah, the he's... night that I will fall for <laughs> yeah. you. You, you know, know, Ed does like My Chemical Romance. That is canon. Yeah. So, um, anyway, that's Ed. <laughs> no. All right, so Grand Blues. Yeah. Hey, Ed. <laughs> <laughs> but, but no, Ed so far seems like maybe one of the one of the better characters in the game. And like, I just like controlling space with his fireballs, with his normals. Although his normals can be slow. So like, in my experience at least, checking drive rush with this character is going to be a bit weird. But overall, like he seems like like Oro from Street Fighter V with like the amount of setups and the amount of like tech he's going to have as a level 2 super. Among other things, like like a lot of his Oki situations are really cool. He's got a lot of safe jumps. His combos are sick. He's gonna be. He's gonna take a long time to really optimize. But I think that 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 when, whenever people optimize the level two setups, the damage he gets, the safe jumps, all that stuff, I think this character can be really really good. Like his anti air, his anti air um like stand heavy kick is mm. might as well be a six P. It's so absurd. <laughs> that normal mm. is crack. Um, his his normals are really hard to get used to in general though. 
So, like, and his DP is kind of weird as an anti air, so you gotta be, like, really, like, you have to, like, kind of time, time it late on, like, other DPs. You have to, like, time, like, like, like where it is. So, it's, it's really strange to anti air with it. But, like, besides that, his, his normals are good. His pressure is fine. Like, it's basic strike, though. He doesn't have a really good plus on block normal, so like you're kind of playing fake pressure. Yeah, the one fight. he has, the one he has, you can crouch. You can crouch it, so like. It's and because he doesn't have an overhead, possible. like you're always crouching. No overhead either, yeah. So, yeah. but he does it again with level two. He can cross you up. He can he can oh, dash yeah. you He's out. He's got he setups. He's got so many setups. Like there's, yeah, it's just pure. RPS. I watched one ending Walker clip that you sent me earlier of like. That wasn't actually ending water. That was VX Bow. He he changed his name to Ending Water. Oh my god! Anyway, that's funny. So <laughs> yeah. he, he was in the right corner, and with one <clears throat> level two, managed to go from the right corner to the left corner, and kill. And it's like this character's so cool. He's, you know what I saw? Shows, what I saw like, was just I don't know. If it, I mean, I was talking to Bootleg about it earlier. He said it was fake yeah, as fuck. Yeah. Like you can like put him in a really tr weird ass like uh, grab loop, like loop grab, whatever uh -huh. grab loop, where like you grab him right, and then you do that charge pullback. So if they block, pull charge snatch there. Yeah, that yeah. When you when you when he grabs you, he like, pulls you back. If they block, well you're plus after that, so you can just grab him it's again. It's super diable. Yeah, you can just drive impact it. Um. Just... Oh, okay. But yeah. Anyway. Yeah, you can just drive I mean, impact it. But when it's you after grab it's and it's like okay, and you know you you might not. Yeah. Think of that. Yeah, because normally his grab doesn't really get really good Oki. Like, like you can grab and then do like do like the the kill switch follow up or like the um like like the bull rush. I think I don't know what it's called. But you can you can like you can like do like like the command dash follow up and you're still plus. You can technically throw a loop, but it's not safe. Like it's it's weird. Yeah, I mean, like, it's, like it's I said, I know, but yeah, you were saying it was fake as fuck. But anyway, you could do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's 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 pretty strong. I don't know anything about Street Fighter. Oh Character <laughs> character is based on in terms of normals the gimmick of Steve Fox from Street Fighter Cross Tekken, yep. where the kicks are flicker punches that have target combos. I think this works really well for Ed, and I think moving forward they've truly they've found his spot. He is oh, yeah, a technical wonderful. boxer that doesn't follow all of the traditional rules of the game, but having to play strongly to the systems of the game. Yeah, I think they found a really strong spot for him in the design department, and the balance department for now seems fine. I gotta wait about six months in the oven to see what that leads to. Yeah, like because we're gonna have to wait a is gonna take forever. Really have an opinion. Seems... It's going to take forever to say anything with confidence on him, other than yeah. we know he's not bad. He's not. No, he's definitely not bad. He's got. He's, he's definitely he's not bad. So That's all we know. How good is he? I don't know. If I see a tier list in the next week with Ed on it, I'm not. You I'm see one out there? The garbage. Public service announcement. Don't listen to them. Yeah, no, th if someone's like, garbage. "Yeah, Ed's a top five character." Don't listen to it. Yeah, Learn no matter who it is, even if it's even if it's like Punk or Mena, don't listen to it. We don't know yet. Um, yeah, no. Character's way too complicated. Do you have a timer? There's so what for much. how long we've been doing this? I have a thing on my OBS. It's 33 okay. minutes. 33 minutes. I right, distracted. Also, Derek, um, towards the beginning, my audio may have been weird because some <laughs> stuff happened, I, but I, I fixed it. It's fine. So, towards um, the beginning, audio may be like kind of weird. Nice. I guess we can use that because we talked about Capcom Cup. You know, we talked about LCQ Balance Patch Ed. I guess we could finally transition to 2B. You want to talk about oh, 2B? Yeah. I'm, yeah, we could talk about 2B. I, mean, I have not. I'm the only one in this call. I don't think who has not played her. I, I have not played, played her because I don't really care I've for the game. You haven't her. played her either? I, Good. I played Thankfully, her. one person here has played her. But I played 2B. Um, Hi. She's cool. 2B is, 2B is so dope. She, I, 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 the way I've been describing her to people is like Fuzzy the character because she has like TK... Like her, her fucking little robot thing that she can grab, like her unique button, she can like grab it, grab it in the air. Yeah. And you could like TK it and, and go for like an instant. I don't know, it's an overhead maybe. I don't even know. Like fucking yeah, but it's an overhead. fuzzy That's what shit, called, yeah. like so easily. Yeah. yeah. And it's like once she gets fully developed, I feel like she's gonna be scary, but like not really because It'll take a bit. I mean, It'll take a bit to get there. Brave point, a brave fucking bullshit. Brave counter. Brave counter. Oh, excuse me. Guard Jesus, we'll, we'll just kind of stop that i feel like um yeah but overall her damage is pretty good her pressure is pretty good um and she definitely plays grand blue um but she's it's just she's playing it differently she's, just, yeah, she's playing it way different yeah it's a different flavor it's not like how also she's definitely playing the game you know she's not like overly broken i think she's probably more mid tier yeah, no. um i don't i'm not like I think Lucius is Lucius, Lucius, Lucilius, whatever. Lucilius. I think he was better. I think he's better, personally. You think he's well, better? we'll have to wait and see, right? We gotta give it some development time. Yeah. 
She's very unique. She's very different. We'll see how it kind of is, and we can revisit this conversation if you have any Grand Blue players on the podcast at some point. Yeah, we could. We can revisit this conversation later down the line. But I I do see potential there from the little bit I've seen. I see a lot of potential, and I think she's really cool. I think it was a genius collab pick for the game. It was. I think they handled her really well. Her like her model looks great. Like I think her in-game model looks great. I think her art a little too much Kumari. A little portrait art. Kumari, I would say. Uh, Yeah, a little bit. A little little much. The 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 self. The the, the Kumar install. (laughs) The Kumar install goes kind of crazy. Kumar install. Yeah, Yeah, the Kumar install is definitely something that if I ever bought two B, I'd only go for. Uh huh. (laughs) Only go for the Kumar install. All right, guys, I landed my combo. (laughs) <laughs> it's like it's like, Yo, it's like Android uh, 16. It's like Derek, you should put a f- after when he goes. Uh, you should add a fart noise. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's um, okay. so we have all this cool stuff. By the presentation's great. Her art's great. Her model's great. Uh, her theme's good because it's way to the I world. I thought you were going to say her ass is good. great. Oh, yeah. I don't know why. Yeah, her ass is <laughs> her, her ass, ass is, is great, great. <laughs> but you know that's a different that's a different discussion. Miles you know great, the, the, the games, great. the games picking back up again, <laughs> which is great. I'm glad to see the games picking up again. Yeah, because they have been they, the games definitely been slowing down a bit, but it's good to see they're picking Steam back up again. I mean, it was destined to slow down a bit. It launched to oh, like yeah. DLC can be always can be a little rocky after the first release, but I think that's why putting 2B so early was so good. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, I'm you're sparking interest back in the game, especially before the first big balance patch. Yeah, smart. I'm definitely very super smart. Excited. Uh, for Vayne after seeing what he could do in like Relink mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. and I think he's going to be I think he could very well be one of the most broken characters in the game and we gotta wait and see yeah. we'll see how yeah, it develops we'll when he gets added and we'll watch this footage and we'll, yeah. we'll report uh, back when we get to see it yeah we'll, 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 we'll have to make like a really a really like, clickbaity title best character in Grand Blue <laughs> Gorilla Gossip number 18 Best character in Graham. It wouldn't even be 18. It'd be like, like six. Uh, is this like Street four. Fighter 2 Akuma? <laughs> <laughs> is this Tekken 7 Akuma? Pet Shop <laughs> in Grand Blue? <laughs> Pet Shop. Yeah. I mean, you know, you know I, I'm excited for all the all of the DLC. There is a lot of people that I want. Like, I, I have you guys played Relink yet? No. Um, no, I have not, but I want to. Damn. There's a character in Relink, uh, one of like the... Uh, like the pro, not what's the no spoilers. Don't don't spoil the game. Not going to. It's like but like you can tell. It's the opposite of the protagonist. What is that called again? Antagonist. The villain. Yeah, it's one. It's one of the antagonists. Uh, There's three of them. There's three of them. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Id, um, Galanza. I think Galantza. I don't know his name. And then Maglia. That sounds like a D's nuts joke. No, it's set up. not. It's not like cool. his name is actually Galanza. Like Galanza, like Galanza or whatever. Uh, and then Magliel. Mm-hmm. And Magliel, I think, out of the three. Or well, I take that back. It, it would be really cool. But Magliel is so cool. Like she mm-hmm. controls like five different weapons, and she would be the coolest zoner. Like period. Mm-hmm. Like she has like mm-hmm. a sword, moral near a gun, a spear, and like a staff or something like that. Right. Cool. And like a lot of potential there to make some cool, like, uh, cool, cool stuff because you can do uh, like yeah. Because you can have like down plus unique if you want simple inputs, or down down like an or like have, B weapon I mean, swap I feel like or something she, like that's cool. I feel like she could uh-huh. be like super zony, or even be like a stance mm-hmm. character with these different weapons, but not really. That's what I would. That's what I would imagine I mean, would be a stance character. I, I definitely like if when you guys play it and you'll see like see her, you'll okay. definitely be like all right, zoner like one hundred percent. Okay, yeah. I think she could be the coolest zoner in a fighting game. Period. All right. Mm-hmm. Cool. Yeah. yeah. We'll see what they end up picking, because I mean they haven't revealed all season one yet, have they? I think they have. I think they've. Uh, Lucius Two B. I will look right Vain. now. What's her name? Um, like Brid- No, Bridget. No, let's. What? What's her name? <laughs> she's in this game too. What's her name? Yeah, she's she's here. She's the blue. I can't think of her name. But and then I th- I think that was all. There might have been one more actually. They like, they revealed pretty much everything at the side games fest. Um, in Japan. Mm-hmm. The, the they have not revealed two characters yet. Okay. Two characters have not been shown. We have Lucilius, 2B, Vane, Beatrix, Beatrix, and two more we don't know about Beatrix. yet. Which that, those two, those two might be shown off during Arc World Tour. They could very well be, but I don't know. Maybe not, because... We, uh, they might show us Vane more during Arc World I Tour. I would say Vane, sure. and then... Yeah. yeah. But... Yeah, and then Galanza, whatever, just has a huge spear. Mm-hmm. And then... Yeah, and then I'm not going to spoil it. Yeah. Because it's more important yeah. than the other two. 
Mm -hmm. um, so, but, yeah. On the topic of DLC and and balance patches, Strive. Ooh. Peacemaker. Oh, no, just is skip this. Funny. Is no, a thing. No, I I don't care. I haven't. Look, we have I to at least care. mention it, okay? No. Thoughts on Peacemaker are simply this. Animation wise, he looks glorious in his intro. He goes from with his tongue out playing an air guitar to stiff as a board. Yeah, That's my like, thoughts on Peacemaker. Oh, they fucking biffed it again. I mean, there's something else with MK1 besides Peacemaker. Oh, crossplay. Oh, yeah. The crossplay thing. No. The crossplay is coming stupid. only on 1v1 modes. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. No, 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 it's not on 1v1 modes. Let's just, not on 1v1 like, modes. We don't even need to talk. No, I thought it was only 1v1. About... I thought it was only the traditional 1v1 that it was coming out. Oh, wait, out. is it? No, it, it basically. Yeah, it is. It, it's only the 1v1 it's mode. Ranked. No, no, it's ranked and like casual play. And then like costs won't happen. Awesome. That's so it. funny. No, they don't have it. Yeah. Anyway, that's MK1. So I'm not gonna play it until Ermac comes out. Probably. MK1 sucks. <laughs> it's it bad sucks. game. Yeah. Ed Boon yeah, yeah, they they have biffed that game every step of the way. Like, yeah. But you know a game that's getting balance patches already regularly. That's another one's coming out after this is already up. Tekken 8 is already on its second patch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is really fast. Did you send me really that? Really fast. You never sent me it. I can send you this right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll put it right in the podcast call. Mm -hmm. That we're not using. So like the DM. Um, there you go. So. It's all in Japanese. Wait, what? Wait, what? Huh? Oh, no, it's not. not. Oh. We're good. Play okay. So no, it's not. What do you want? They, <laughs> the next patch for Tekken 8 is coming on the 28th uh, Pacific Sun. Like, you can't talk. <laughs> the 28th. It's coming out tomorrow as of the time of this recording. Yeah. And they're adding the Tekken shop, which is awesome. I, yeah, I'm, a, I'm, I'm so, very interested about what that is. Yeah, be. so Tekken Shop, they, they they explained it in the Tekken Talk if you watched it. And they showed it. Every two times a month, they will be adding a skin to it. So two Ooh, new skins per month. I see a cool Claudio That are classic, classic character outfits. So Tekken Tag 2 Asuka, Tekken 4 Jin, uh, Tekken yeah. 6 Kazuya, and then I think it was Tekken 4 Zhao. You were the first ones coming. Four U.S. dollars a costume, the ultimate middle finger to Capcom, charging about ten dollars for an outfit three in Street Fighter, yeah. <laughs> um, which is awesome. They're fixing some glitches. Um, first collab where you get some free stuff. You're getting free stuff. None of that's going to cost money. None of the Uniqlo yeah. items will cost any money. But there is a balance patch, and I didn't really read much of it. I kind of skimmed through it earlier, but. They definitely looked at some of the problems and fixed stuff. Mm -hmm. um, the things that they did right away was any hold moves. So, like, the thing I think of is Asuka. I play Asuka, so I think of her rage art where she can hold it. Yeah. That no longer can 180, right? These moves wow. you could hold used to literally be able to 180 in certain situations, and they took that out. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That uh, That's, like, a bug that they fixed, so... In the case of Asuka, you still can't really sidestep her once uh, because she can release and catch you. But if you do double really fast, you can get behind her and she cannot U-turn yeah. in time. So there's clear counterplay to stuff like that now uh, consistently, which is just overall good for the game. They fixed a lot of glitches with stages and oh. like crashes with stages. They, um, they fixed Victor's throw thing. They fixed Victor's throws finally. Victor will no longer be the easiest character in the game to win with. Yeah. I still think he might be the easiest in the game to play as someone who plays one of the easiest in the game. Yeah. But uh, he no longer is a borderline, like, impossible to beat character, and uh -huh. that is a big deal. Because, like, you think about it, 20 to 13 frame throw tech window, 13 still sounds generous, but when it's a 1 plus 2... Yeah. Or a 3 plus 4, that's not generous at all. Yeah, that's, no, like, it, actually it, it terrible. Looked, it looked cancerous. It was terrible to deal with. You literally had to, basically... Against Victor, you had to opt to either go Ultra Instinct and tech these grabs, or duck more often, and you don't want to do that because Victor has mids that kill you. Yeah. It was very not fun. Um, but I'm glad that they addressed that so early. They nerfed a bit about Elisa, it seems, which is awesome because she was a little bit degenerate. They nerfed some, some stuff. Uh, Asuka got some very minor buffs. Like it's so, it's basically like we fixed the some of this stuff missing or swapping sides, and uh, we made down forward one um, work. What's ninety one Gusto? Yeah, that's her install where her hands go like bloop. Oh, right. And it it makes her certain moves have like better follow ups. Yep. Yeah. Um, Azucena 
Um, like Dennis Susana got buffed. Yeah, she needed to be nerfed. Um, yeah, adjusted no. the tracking, hitboxing, opponent collision, pursuit moves, and with making. Yeah, she got buffed. So, but yeah, I she mean, needed to be nerfed. I'll, I'll mean, actually it, let me read you this. So the, with heat activated, liberate, join liberator, take high damage from the opponent. Yeah, so um, liberator got buffed. That's the only thing that got buffed. Which I'm, what was liberator? Liberator is that like that stance where she's like dancing and like if you you can't do you can only do mids. You can only hit her with mids. Okay, yeah, that one, that one. Yeah, okay, I would say like Her which one because there's a couple, oh, but the one where you can't stance. do mids, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Well, besides back stance. I guess they just visually look different depending on how she's moving, right? I mean, kind of. Like, well, when she like she, she, this is the one where like she looks like she's doing like the chicken dance when she's walking. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay, but to be fair, I'm reading what they did do it, and I agree with what they did do it. They right. made it. They made it slightly further so that it doesn't whiff in spots where it shouldn't have whiffed. I don't really consider making the character work as intended a buff. Uh, but it definitely is an improvement, therefore technically well, is like, a buff, they buffed, right? Well, they buffed um, the point to where it says, like, during Liberator, take low attack, uh, adjusted the tracking. And yeah, no, you read, the, but it says fixed. They made these work the way it was always supposed to work. It was a glitch. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, Brian, you can no longer hide the install, which is awesome. Um, they nerfed Claudio on one of his moves. I mean, they, didn't. they nerfed him. They did. Reduce the knockback distance when the opponent attack is blocked, making it easier for the opponent's counterattacks to connect. So they nerfed Claudio. Yeah. Wow. Uh, um, that's that actually. That's back. Oh. That's back four. No, three, that's four. Back main, three, four. I don't main, know what. That's his main extender. I think that's Tornado's. Too, okay. So. But no, I actually kind of like how they added Starburst, like an icon for Starburst. But they, they really yeah, they did that for they did that for Nani Augusto, Starburst, they uh, Snake Eyes. Because like you just Snake look at his fucking hands. If they're blue, he yeah, has it's really Starburst. hard to see. It. It's not that mm -hmm. hard to see. Yeah, but still, still, I think it's a good improvement regardless. It just means that <coughs> like you can't wear gloves to make it harder to spot, right? I think that's just an improvement. Okay. Oh yeah. Dragonov got some minor nerfs. Um. Feng got fixed. Warang got buffed. June, that's here on dance, I think. That's just heat. Uh, June during heat second a little bit bigger difficult. Okay, so they just made a lot of moves work in this patch. Yeah. They made King. I think they fixed some of his problems, and then they they nerfed him a little bit. Wait, they changed the throw escape. Yeah, they changed it oh, because really? uh, one wasn't working. Oh, so instead of fixing it, they just moved it over to a different. Place. Okay, fair enough. Fair yeah. enough. All right, it, for Burning Hammer, which yeah, I don't know. They still can't fix the King players only play on Wi-Fi though. Hey. Yeah, As that's law. Pla that's law games. players. That's law players, yeah, that's bro. <laughs> king players. Any King player I've ever fought yeah. is on Wi-Fi. Overall, they fixed the, th the glitches that the game still had. The major glitches. They fixed a lot of stages. They fixed a lot of characters. They added the icons. And they're adding tech. They're adding um, more cosmetics to the game this early. I think they have hit a home run here. Yeah. I think they've really they've really found their stride this early. And obviously they've got the list. Oh. The list. Harada's list, which we got an update on Harada's ban list earlier because he just got sent. He got sent a new version of it recently. And I'll pull up the tweet right now so I can read it out to you and everyone else. <laughs> Am I on so it? It's In so this, sick. no. Yay. Harada's Harada's list tweet. Um. There's Still a lot of people Twitter. that Hold need on. to be banned. I, I mean... I'm about to read to this to you. Now Michael has sent the development team and me a huge Excel list. The file name of that Excel is List of Fuckers to Ban. Yeah. And it contains a lot of unplugging, particularly bad players, and those who com who brag about their plugging behavior on social media sites are, are circled in a bloody red box. Yeah, they're gone. Um, so, what does this mean? People are getting banned soon for being terrible. That's the first thing. So people in the Hitler costumes, your days are numbered. I hate you all. But, but, low tier God is getting banned. There's oh, no way he's dodging it, bro. Low tier, God's gone. low tier God's gone, dude. He's gone. Every stream, I, I have never, I've watched a couple of his Tekken 8 streams. I have never seen him finish a set. Yeah. I've never seen him even finish more than one game. Like. The dude is getting banned. He's gone. Um, he's going to get that ass banned. Yeah, it's over. It's, it's his turn. There's a certain player. panda player that I can't say <laughs> the name of that's going to get banned. Yep, they're getting banned too. Yep, yeah. yeah, they're gone. Uh, I'm glad. All the boosters are going to be gone. So they're, they're already getting to work on cleaning the game out. 
which yeah. is nice. I appreciate that. I have a feeling. That. I appreciate I, that. I'm, I'm very scared that the wrong people, like, they might accidentally wrong, ban the wrong person. I hope they just add a, they, they email or, or reach out to everyone who gets banned with a thing saying, we have given you this so you can appeal your ban and we will go on a case-by-case -case basis throughout the next month to see. Yeah. If you can't make a good case, whatever. If you can, cool. Like, if you can prove, I'm, un I'm not unplugging. My internet goes out a lot. Right. Then good. Yeah. They'll let you through, yeah. right? Because um, it's also on their end, they have to protect the players who are getting unplugged on. That's the other thing. They have to protect the other players. So they, yeah. You lose your win streak if someone unplugs you, and you have a win streak bonus for points, so you lose points for getting unplugged on. Yeah, it's kind of ass. Um, like, you, you get punished for that happening, which should not be happening. They're going to... They're going to address these things Definitely over not. time, but I do think they should have protect, first off protected the players before they started banning people. Mm -hmm. But whatever. I don't, I don't make games. I play them. Right? Yeah. I scream about them on the internet. Real. Um, at the time of recording, they're going to be doing the ARC World Tour talk tomorrow with a, a big surprise. By the time this goes up, you know what the big surprise was. Abba Guilty Gear. I know. I can't wait Abba to Guilty play Gear. ABBA. Or dizzy. I will. You know, what, uh, I have it. an idea. Shen, um, add whatever when I'm right on. Okay. I can't. When I'm right at a. I can't <laughs> wait to play if, dizzy. If Shoji's right, put one of the characters on screen. If Shoji's wrong, put a monkey on screen eating a banana. Okay. Yeah. Boo does his bananas like popsicles. I, there you I go. can't Indiana. wait to play Dizzy. She's going to be awesome. I can't wait to play go. ABBA. She's going to be awesome. <laughs> I can't wait to play Raven. It just lists off She's every character. Awesome. Just every character. Or he's going to be awesome. Well, if it's wait Raven, I'm never playing the game again. If it's Raven, you're playing the game with me every single day. No. If, it, if, it, if it's Raven, I'm, I'm uninstalling Shy. If it's if Raven, it's, if it's Raven, y'all will fucking deal with it because then I, I have my main back. It. Okay? I hate Raven. Fuck so y'all. He is not cringe. He is the coolest <laughs> Raven motherfucker. Raven is cringe, bro. In Exer. <laughs> just because so y'all so have cool, drama. The cool, the cool in question is just... <coughs> it's a... Just like, because <laughs> y'all have trauma doesn't mean he ain't cool. I don't even have the no. trauma. I just don't like him. No, I have trauma for for sin in that in Exard. Okay, I, I have no trauma for Raven. Yeah, I just fuck have you, Widow. There's hate in my heart know. for Raven. I'm sorry. Hey, my character's balanced ish and strive. Ish? Huh? Ish. Ish. Uh -huh. He does too much damage. Anyway. He does uh, too much damage. If he didn't do so much damage, he'd be balanced. But for now, it's ish. Right. My care, my Buff Potemkin. Arc system works. All right. Let's just, let's just yeah. kick her. Save let's A boy. Buff Potemkin. Um, Save me. <laughs> let's just kick him. Let's just kick him. Out what of happened the to the game um, I love? Nerf White Wild Assault. They said Buff Pot. Oh, please. Nerf all of them. <laughs> Nerf all of them. Anyway, Buff Melia. Get, just get, get uh, them Buff Capel. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I will kill you. You're out of your mind. You're out of your mind. Get out. Your you're off the line. podcast. No. Yeah, no, you're, I, I, I'm the, I'm the it's new gonna host. be like food battle. Me and my new favorite podcast yeah. host. <laughs> I'm um, the host now. Hello. Yeah, I know. Uh, what else is we? What have we? What have we missed? I feel like we missed a big thing. I don't know. I um, mean, we kind of talked a lot. Um, is there like what oh. did we miss? Uh, we have. I mean, this is gonna go after up after that, so I can't. Wait. That doesn't matter. Um, she. I don't know. What did we? I feel like we did miss something. Um, <sighs> when like, did I, we? Re I well, actually, we recorded last episode a while. I guess Uni Two came out. Yeah. I guess that's like we haven't. Yeah. Um, it's doing all I'm, right. Well, I mean, it's, we, fine, it's been yeah. like five months since we last recorded. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Uni is doing fine enough. I mean, they chose the worst day of all time to release it, and but it's holding up poorly. Yeah, the PC, they released poorly, and they couldn't have released it on a worse PC day. Released really yeah. poorly, but it's still Console doing pretty well. Fun. Though, like, like they're still. It's doing good. Us. They bounced back. They bounced back, yeah, which is awesome. Console is fun. Super it's glad really. to see it. Um, but you know, I, I love Uni. I'm having fun on it, but like, nice. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna play Tekken Eight more. I've been playing way too much Tekken. I am at Flame Ruler rank in ninety four and a half hours. Nice. Uh, were you I have been playing a lot of Tekken. In Uni. Um. Don't you play Jack Panda, right? I mean, I, I just play Jack uh, in Tekken 8. Oh, okay. I, I think I'm in, I'm in an Uni. Uni? Uni? Oh, in, oh, in Uni? Uni? Um, oof. <laughs> um, yeah. Seth, maybe. No, that's Jack. Oh, wait, what? Jack plays Seth. 
Oh really? Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, then I have no, I have no fucking. Long clue. noodle boy. I have no. Wait, what? Long noodle boy. Oh. Merkava. Oh, you play Merkava. Oh, Merkava player. Oh. Yeah, ew. I know exactly who that is. Do you? Merkava's the yeah, big yeah. alien guy. That's my, that's my favorite. Oh. He's a big puppy. Yeah, I actually do know who that is. Yeah. I actually do know who that yeah, is. Yeah. He's, he's the big alien yeah. guy who grabs you from full screen. I was making no. this big bit about having no idea anything about Uni, and then I'm like, wait a minute, that's like one of the only characters I know about. <laughs> wait a second. Uh, okay, I know, I, I like to guess, I don't know why, but I like to guess who, like, people would play, and I feel like I know who Widow would play, and Trinity, you can be like, well, yes, no, I think if Widow ever okay. played the game, they would play, they would somehow get to Wagner. Wagner? Think about it. Oh, I pulled up the, the thing. I, I can kind of see it. Right? I, I can kind of see I it. I feel I'll like they'd be a Wagner player. Maybe, yeah. Yeah. I can see or it. Or Laundrakia, maybe. Uh, mm. No? No, not, not, I don't think so for that one. No? Larry Sky? I think, I, I think Wagner, though, could probably be it. Yeah. I... I I don't know. I, I that's just. I hate you guys because I just read. I just read on the wiki. What Wagner does. Her strengths, and I'm like, you motherfuckers. Yeah, that's right. Like you're <laughs> dead right, and I hate it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, it's too. It's too right. easy to guess the characters I play. So what do you like right. in a character? Simple. All right, mid range. Offense can be strong if played correctly. Oh no. That's yeah. the characters Her I play. Oscar is, is defensive neutral and mid range into offense that can be unstable if you don't layer it right. Mm. Sin is the same way, because if you yeah. don't lay your offense ready in some with a brain, it's never going to work. They will 2P you every time. No, if you wanted to like, play uh, The somebody, only exception might be Terry, because Terry's offense is pretty tight. If you wanted to play yeah. somebody that didn't have a brain, like you could just go in and be good with, it would be the new shield guy. Oh, I, that I guy. Be, um, yeah, um, Sarugi? Yes, he's the most he's brainless yeah. fucking gorilla had of had a, had a character ever. Fuck that character. I mean, Leo White Fang's right there. I mean, Leo, this is Strive. Our, our boss is listening. Our boss is listening. It's not Strive. <laughs> this is not Strive. This is... <laughs> no, we're... Yeah. Is, Leo White Fang is It's different. Different, different things game. make a gorilla in different games. <coughs> no, the, the Leo of this game is um, is uh, no one. Um, there is none. No one. Uh, no one's Leo. No, no one. We are, we are more dignified in this area we of more, the we FTC. Do, we do not flash kick after minus two. Uh, we do no. not We do not eat bananas. I mean, to get you eat bananas. Um, <laughs> My banana eating impression. Anyway. Well, I, I also eat bananas. Yeah, we know. You play sin. Yeah, I actually have bananas uh, in the kitchen. I'm bananas are pretty good. <laughs> you play sin in NASCAR. We know you eat bananas. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, and they're I, delicious. They're de mm. I feel like there's so much more we, we were supposed to talk about. Or we could have Where talked about. I mean, but then again, I don't. I got nothing. I, I got nothing. I think, I think we've pretty much covered everything we were gonna talk about. Street Fighter. We talked about all oh, the state of fighting games right now. Um, I guess we can talk a little bit about oh, the future oh, of this podcast oh, in general, um, very briefly, if we want. We, what, what? I mean, we haven't. We talked about Frosty. And that happened. Yeah, Frosty Faust. I mean, I was the only Good one event. That, that, that that was there, physically. Out of everyone uh, here. Yeah, yeah, everyone here. Um, I didn't even watch any of the streams, to be honest with you. Damn. I didn't even know what was happening. <laughs> huh? All right. Uh, do I did not know what was happening. Uh, uh, let me just go fuck myself. Um, yeah. Everyone go flame them in the comments right now. Yeah. Say Trent, hey, no, Trinity, no. stupid head. I mean, poop. I, that, that's what you I need mean, to type to in the fair, comments right now. They were right late now. for the recording, so like, like, yes, do it. You know. Okay, no, you <laughs> cannot blame this on me. Okay, I'll have you know, I was right, streaming Widow? Ed, you know? and Shoji said, "I'm gonna go take yeah. a shower," and I was like, it's "Okay, all, I'll play till he's done." Yeah. Yeah. They come it's back all. half an hour later, and Shoji's like, "Where are you?" But for you to tell me, it's like all Trent's fault for being late. Like. Yeah. Even if Widows agrees, will... it's crazy. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, you know? I'm filing a copyright claim on this video. <laughs> <laughs> a copyright <laughs> claim? For what? For being late? There's no, everyone, <laughs> everyone shush and listen. Huh? You hear that? There's no copyrighted music. Or music at all, My probably. There's nothing. All, you know? Oh, really? Yeah. By, by who? Who owns the trademark? Me. <laughs> really? Are you sure you own the trademark, your own voice? 100%. I want you to look at... Lock your windows tonight. Oh. <laughs> <Lock> your windows. <laughs> uh, anyway. Um, yeah. I guess we can quickly segue into what this podcast is going to be shaping up in the next couple we're months. I thought we about Frosty, but okay, yeah. 
Oh yeah. Well, we kind of <laughs> there's not much to go over. It happened, and people were there, and, and Newhead was there, and they were doing cool shit. Yeah, I mean, we did a lot of stuff. That's like about it. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you're so right. So the podcast. Yeah, podcast. Um, the thing you're watching right now, the thing you're listening to right now. You know, we're on Spotify now. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, we can. Um, not just Spotify, uh, but you can. Yeah. You can listen to us anywhere you listen to podcasts. Apple Podcasts. Wow. Apple Podcasts. I'm listening right now. Oh, my God. That's so awesome. Fuck. I'll yeah. have to go listen to you on my own podcast right yeah, now. Yeah, I'll have to go listen to the to the new head podcast, Gorilla Gossip, right now, while I'm labbing combos and sucking dick at fighting games. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Are you at work? Are you <laughs> bored? Do you have an earbud? You know what to do. Come listen. Are you anyway, in the jungle, eating bananas with other, with other monkeys? <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, New Head is a fighting game focused uh, org, but at the end of the day, the people that run the show on the podcast or in the tournaments everywhere are people mm -hmm. that have lives outside of the FGC. Mm -hmm. And so, while obviously fighting games will always be a part of the podcast, we're not always going to be talking about them. Sometimes we're just going to talk about, oh, I was at Subway the other day. And they pissed on my Without sandwich. Me? Without Damn. Me. Okay, Subway. Not Subway that, didn't that do that. On me. That one was on Subway. Me. Hey, we should probably sponsor us, please. No, don't. Please, please, I'm begging you. I'm on my. I knees. like Jersey Mike's better. <laughs> Send me a free sandwich. Jersey Mike's is better. Jersey Mike's. I've never had Jersey Mike's. Subway is my favorite restaurant. Um. Anyway. Um. Speaking about yeah. life. The podcast please. is gonna be a lot of stuff. Yeah. I I have medical shit, so like literally IBS, and I have to shit. So let's end this. <laughs> you know? No, that's perfect. That's, that's perfect. perfect. We cut it right there. Yeah. Thank right, you so for watching episode it. two of Gorilla Gossip. You should start seeing this thing more regularly on YouTube, on Apple Podcasts, on Spotify. Everywhere. <laughs> Everywhere possible. Go yeah. subscribe to the new head um, YouTube. Okay. I hope you have a good rest of your day, good rest of your night, whatever you're doing right Thank now. Thank you, Trinity, D, for coming Thank on. Thank you for listening. Yes, of course. You're thank awesome. you to Trinity for helping us, helping us talk Street Fighter. Hell yeah! Yes. Because if it was just me here carrying that, it would have been like, all right, Ed. We would, we, we, we would have kept. Got uh, we would have kept what I said about Ed uh, as like the main thing. Yeah. yeah. All right, so we got purple. That stuff, would have been yeah. it. That would have been it. The purple shit. He's yeah. got a disadvantage. He's got a he neutral. got advantage. He's, he's a character. Yep. He's, he's a character. All right. All right. <laughs> have a good night. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Yeah. Stared at the camera awkwardly there, like a dipshit.